What's up guys, Maniacs here, and welcome to Monaxia, or Monaxia. I have no idea how to pronounce it properly, I believe with that little dash up there, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be Monaxia. Now, this game popped up the other day on itch.io, and this game looks kind of cool. It's based around the fact that a survivor of a recent ship crash, you were the only survivor, and you wind up on this island. It's an unknown island, you have no idea, so kind of like Lost style, I guess. And apparently, it's your job to basically find out what happened and try to get your memories back, because somehow, in the accident of you getting here, you lost your short-term memory. So now it's your job to figure out what happened. Apparently there's notes and stuff all over this island and it's your job to figure out what happened and more or less survive. Now, I don't know exactly how extensive the exploration of this game is, but the island, I don't know how big it is either. I have no idea how long this game is. I don't even know if it technically has an end, but from what I've seen, it looks like a type of game that's kind of like, um, oh God, what the heck was that game that came out? Uh, the Forest, there we go, where you kind of end up there and it's your job to more or less pilfer like the land you know destroy trees and build houses like the one you guys can see over there on the right now i did notice that yesterday i said that i was probably going to stream today i also decided to redo my computer yesterday so i'm still trying to figure out everything to make sure everything is working with that and plus the only thing that really came out today was final fantasy and i didn't know if you guys would even care to really watch it plus janelle is a little busy over there so uh, we'll decide. We'll probably end up streaming something tomorrow, but I did like the fact that a couple of people did give me suggestions for it. I would like to do a lot of those games. Like I said, I can't do a bunch of them because you can't split the screen ups yet, but eventually we'll be able to stream stuff like on our own consoles and stuff like that. And I'll get it so you guys can actually watch both of us and whatnot. It's actually not too difficult, especially with OBS. So let's start this game. Okay. Literally starts out right there. All right. I need water. I do really like the music. I will absolutely admit that. I'll admit that very much so. And apparently that's the ship, huh? That's a very tiny ship. That's like a canoe. Not even that. Sound design is really good. I do really like the pixelated style gra- or not pixelated, but the polygon style graphics. There we go. How everything's kind of blocky and whatnot. I know I've said this in the past that I really like that. So the bottom bar, if you guys can see in the bottom left, is my stamina. And then the top one, I'm assuming, is my health. And then maybe the one under that is water. Now, obviously, you can't just drink salt water because that's just going to make you sick. What is that? This game does look good. And I do really like the, the music. Of course, I say that in music style. Okay, there we go. And the stomping and everything like that that your character makes going to the brush is pretty cool. This island doesn't look super big. And I believe this was part of a jam, uh, game jam. I don't know exactly what the game jam was. I just noticed a comment on the game itself. Oh, cool. Also, when you get up here, the wind and everything gets much louder, too. Kind of cool. So I don't know how extensive this game is yet when it comes to everything being done with it. When it comes to, like, the exploration and whatnot, I'm tired. Okay, I gotta be careful of that. Holy crap, the... That is very loud. Okay, can I go into the water? Alright. Okay. I... Did I just die? What just happened? Okay, we're back. Let's try that again. I still need water. I don't know where I can actually get water from, but note to self, do not go into the water. Also, why is there an SOS thing over here? Even though... I haven't been here long enough to put that up. Alright, so is this like Lost Style where there's actually been people here the whole time? I have no idea. So again, I think the top bar on the on the on those bars is my health. The second one down I'm assuming is water. The one after that I'm maybe hunger. And then obviously the bottom one is my stamina. God, I really like the piano riff in the background. But I need to find water first. I'm assuming it's the type of thing where you need to kind of like follow the directions of the character first. And then the game will open up and allow you to go and explore different things and find different notes. Oh, there's a campsite. Oh. Oh, what did I just... Did I just eat something? Did I just eat... Did I just... Uh... Okay, I just ate a mushroom. Is that good? That's probably bad. I just ate a random mushroom sitting on top of a hill. That's probably really bad. Okay. So E is just standard, like, grab something or whatnot. And I haven't found any notes yet, but I am still very thirsty. Okay, I'm stuck. And as I was saying before, this game, I believe, is part of a jam, but I don't know what jam it is because it didn't say anything on the actual page for it on itch. And the only thing reason I know that it was some type of jam is because... Can I crawl in there? I can't crouch or anything like that. And clicking on the tent does nothing. Okay. So I'm wondering if... If that tent's already there, is there a cabin, like the one that we saw on the main screen? 
Is that already here? Alright, so I'm getting my health back every time I eat those mushrooms, but am I gonna, like, suddenly get high or something like that? Because that probably wouldn't be good sitting on the random island. You know, seeing my situation, the fact that I have no water or anything. And there's a bench right here. That is so a bench. Oh, I just... What the hell did I just eat? Okay. There's a bench here. Why is there a bench here and a small... That wasn't... Was that there before? Or did I just totally miss that? There's like a, a fence. Mmm, bananas. Good potassium. Not much of a fan of bananas. Unless it's like banana pudding or something like that. Which is weird because that's like a concentrated banana taste. I'm weird. Well, here's a well. Can I get water from that? Oh, I can. Okay. Roll it back up. Doesn't look like there's any water in there. Oh, there we go. All right, well, I'll just kind of leave that in there. Awesome. Okay, so when you do that, it automatically drinks it. Cool. All right, so I have pretty much full health. I have full water. And I'm assuming, again, I think that might be hunger. But I didn't really notice it whenever I was eating any of the wild mushrooms that I'm taking. I'm surprised that I'm not totally high right now or something. Something along those lines. Look, there's the cabin. All right, cool. So this stuff is actually here. I thought that it was going to be a type of thing where I had to build it. Never mind. I totally was wrong when it comes to the whole fact that this could be like the forest. I mean, it could technically still kind of not really be, but you guys know what I mean. Just ate another mushroom. I love how the music restarts every time too. Can I get the axe? No, I can't pick it up. Oh, I can go inside too. Okay. Day 270. I've never been fond of diaries, don't know why, but here I am in the middle of the ocean on an island that is the size of two football fields, writing a diary. Like I said, if it was up to me, I would never start writing writing one, but my wife thinks it may help me at keeping my sanity in the godforsaken place. How did you talk to your wife? Is she there with you? I have no idea. My mind is still not clear. I'm having trouble remembering things. Maybe writing them down in order can help me. I know we are heading to fill out to fill for our 15th anniversary. Oh, to Fiji. Sorry. I had planned out every single detail, but something happened. What was it? It's all blurry. Hard to tell what exactly happened. There's a radio. Okay. So who built all of this? Like, are these my diary things and I just, like, forgot? Or, or what? Here's another... Maybe, like, a failed SOS thing or something like that? There's another mushroom. Might as well... Fuck it, if you're trapped on an island, get high. The only way to make yourself survive. Don't do it. Don't just go eat wild mushrooms in the forest. That's not good. There are way more... I'm tired. How are you tired? Fuck you! You're tired. You have full food and full... You know, or you have full health, and you have full water. Stop complaining, and let's go figure out what happened. I want to find out more stuff, and why these trees are, like, red, and some are green. Like, I love how there's regular pine trees, and then there's other trees, and then there's, like, red trees, like, Minecraft style. Like, biomes, I guess, is the thing that I was trying to say. Why couldn't I say biomes? Stop saying you're tired. I tried to sleep in the bed. I went up to the bed and I clicked E, nothing happened. And I can't crouch or anything like that, so... I'm assuming he's saying he's tired because I'm sprinting a lot. Fine, I'll eat another mushroom. Dude, get high, man. I haven't really found any other ops... Any other things. Like, I'm assuming, like, landmark... Oh, I'm stuck. Landmarks, like, the, the cabin and whatnot, are going to have more diary pieces. But I came across some things earlier and nothing seemed to change. All right, I'm back here at the cabin. I can't do anything with that. I can't do anything with the radio. Blah, 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 blah. I read both of the notes. Woo, okay, cool. All right, so you guys will notice that my health is down a little bit more. I restarted the game to see if I could get something to spawn or change or whatnot. So I got the fire going. I'm not gonna turn it off because before I accidentally turned it off, I don't know how I managed to do that. But I looked at, I went back onto the page for the game itself and I looked up and I see the screenshots and there are more pages that I can find in the world. I just don't know what I need to do. Like my character's not thirsty anymore, the fire is going, so that's good. But there were more pages scattered around the level. I just don't, and I, I like there's one definitely by that well. So unless there's another well in the game or 
I don't really know. But the well is over here. Okay, now there's a page over here. This page was not here before. So you have to start at the house and then work your way around, I'm assuming. So you have to go to each different thing at different times. Okay, sure. That makes sense. I understand, but it'd be nice if you could pick them up. So, all right. So she might be right after all. I mean, there is something relaxing about writing a diary under the shade of a tall coconut tree and sipping th fresh water from the well near our shed. The diary thing, it can work out for me. Okay, so that was another diary page. So where's the next one? Ah, cool. I found the next one. The next one's over here. Can I light this? No, I can't. Okay, so this is the next one. Day 310. It's all coming back to me. I now remember that we encountered a typhoon on our way to Fiji and our ship had sunk because of it. First thing I remember about the island is waking up on the beach with a throbbing ache in my head. I immediately yelled to find my wife after joining, after gaining my conscience, consciousness. I wasn't even sure if she was alive or not. I remember trying to hope for the best and eventually finding her passed out on the beach. I can't describe the relief I felt at that very moment. Okay. So, the next... I don't know where the next page might be. Um... Oh, okay, here we go. It's over here by the SOS. Alright, this took forever. Day 316. I went to the beach this morning to see if there were any ships passing by, but I had no luck seeing one. While I was heading back, I saw the big SOS sign we made on our first week here. It, w it, has, hold up it has hold up really well in the last year or so. Year? Damn! But I can't say that it's working. I'm not sure if it will... If we will, if we will, we will. Okay, he meant, meant bleh, the direct. Wow. <sighs> the creator of the game messed that up. If we will be able to leave this island or not. Okay, so I got that one. So he's been here over a year at this point. Don't know if we will be able to leave the island. I can see a note right here. So luckily this is the next one. Day 328. Eating bananas back home was somewhat of a special occasion, but here I am sick of them. It's all we have to eat, and it is starting to get annoying. We have to start finish we have to start fishing or something. Okay, so fishing. Well, there's a little canal over here, so is there like a thing over here that they want me to connect? See, because I already got that one up there on that rock up there. And they can be on pretty much anything. They can be on a rock or more or less anything, so. I gotta be careful. The only significant there's one around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. The only thing I have is the fact that the audio changes. Day 364. Our days on this island may be coming to an end. We used the radio that washed up with the ship's wreckage to call for help. To call to call for help a couple of days ago and just got a response from the rescue team. They are coming to save us in a short time, but my wife is not fond of leaving the island. She thinks fate brought us to this island and that we should stay. I feel the same. Okay. Oh, there's a thing down there. There's a new one. Luckily, I could see that one. Just can't... It sucks that I can't just, like, jump into the water and run over to it, though. Like, I don't know if it's just... It was just a bug that I ran into earlier, but when I jumped into the water, I was instantly dead. So, good thing to know. At least I could see that one from there. I guess I got the little note, like, okay, going to the beach. That makes sense for the other one that I was running around for five minutes trying to find. And there's only so many significant landmarks, but... All right, Day 375, rescue team just arrived, but we had to tell them to leave. It's hard to leave this island after living here for so long. So we made our choice. Rescue team tried to convince us, but we are determined to stay. Fuck that. Why would you stay? Is there some magical thing on this island that you ha still have yet to write in your notes or journals or anything like that? So there's a tent over here. I'm curious if the next one's over here at this tent. Yep, it is because I can hear it changing. All right, day 390. My wife got really sick after the rainstorm yesterday. Her fever isn't going down. I am trying my best to help her and make her feel comfortable. Things are not looking great. I fear the worst is yet to come. Okay, so now I think the next diary page is going to be the one over there that looks like the grave. That's what that looks like. It looks like a grave on a hill. So I'm going to head over there and see if that's the right one. Yep, I can hear it. Yep, music changed. This must be the last one. And I knew this looked like a grave. Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. Day 402. I... I can't. There's no point in living anymore. Not without her. She was my everything. My fulcrum. I will leave this place with her. Yes. Yes. I will. Oh. 
Oh. Oh, okay. So, that was the game. Alright, so I will admit, there is a lot of backtracking back and forth. And the thing of the fact that you don't have infinite sprint is... So oh, there's actually to be continued. Cool. I like the fact the developer put that in there. Hopefully they'll stick with it, because there's a lot of games that don't. That was pretty cool. I would love to see more of this island. Like, why? what was the reason that kept them there? Like, obviously the island was pretty. We'll absolutely admit that. But they got a response. The rescue team actually showed up, and they basically told them to leave, which is weird. Like, what is up with that island that made them want to stay? And apparently it seems like that guy just ended up killing himself after he lost his wife, which I don't blame him because that would really suck to be stuck on an island completely by yourself, like, you know, Tom Hanks and Castaway or something like that. Not a bad game, I will not admit, aside from the fact that there's a lot of backtracking back and forth and trying to find where the next actual, like, clue is, and the only difference that you have is the fact that the music changes when you get towards one, but the fact that the music changes to any different one, to any one that you go to, even ones that you've already gotten to, that can be a little confusing, and the fact that you can't pick the pages up can be also a little confusing. I think it would be nice that once you actually find, get to a page, you pick the page up and the music will stop. That way, you okay, it signifies that you have that one and you can't, like, walk past it and think did I get that one already is that one that I already got I don't know all in all pretty cool little game I like the graphic style the music is very nice especially the music right there at the end with the fact that he was like the sad music where he lost his wife I like the graphic style I love the polygon style and I'm curious to see how the developer is going to continue this but for a game jam game I think it is a game jam game like I said I don't know exactly what game jam it is but for a game jam game developer this was pretty cool so with that that is all the time I got for today, guys. Let me know what you guys thought of this game in the comment section below. If you guys want to check this game out yourself, there'll be a link to it in the description below. Developer, nice job. Aside from the constant, like, back and forth, nice little game. Thank you all so much for watching. Check out the annotations for more videos that I've done. Again, let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought of the game, and I'll see you guys next time. Maniacs out. Hi. Oh, now we're going to have to She's fight this guy. She's going through some major mood swings. She's like, like, I'm so like, happy. I'm so this sad. Guy's I'm so happy. Oh, I don't know. Oh, like you killed my friend or my guy. Oh, I, I, there's a bunch of look like eyeballs that are blinking or uh